What's up YouTube? Checking out the Frequent Fly and I'm back out here. This time I'm out here with the King Kong 110 GT and I was I just got done flying the Blade Torrent 110 out here and I just felt like I needed to bring this King Kong 110 out here just for a reference flight. Uh, I am doing a little experimentation with this thing. So I got these dual bladed props on here. These are actually cut down. I think they're Rotor X props. I'm not entirely sure. Somebody gave these to me in another build and I just took them off that build and threw them on this thing. These actually came with my uh, Mako 130, the Mako 130 from Killer Clowns FPV. I just borrowed these props off of it and threw it on the King Kong 110 GT. And it flies nice with them. About the, about the same punch. It flies a little longer with these props than it does with the three bladed props that it comes with stock. But let's get this thing in the air so I could do a quick reference flight. Okay, we're gonna do a quick punch out with this one. So very big difference in this one and the other one. The torrent, let's look at it again. Lot faster and a lot more nimble. We're in acro mode. Man, I can't turn towards that direction because the sun is blinding me. But as you guys can see, this thing is a lot more agile than that one is. It feels a whole lot lighter in the air, it flies with a lot more power. A lot more speed and all. Oh, I forgot I got wires down here. Every time I fly this quad, dragonflies always go after it. None of them have actually crashed into it, but they all go for it. Hopefully none of them fly into the blades but every time I bring this thing out here they go after it so this one in the blade torrent it's night and day between the two I think the blade torrent goes for 200 Bind and fly. This thing goes for a little over 100. You guys, I don't know if you guys will pick that up on camera, but a dragonfly just missed it just now. They keep going after it. Maybe it's the sound that it makes because I've seen other videos where bumblebees attack quads. I think it has something to do with the sound that these blades make. Oh, and I forgot to mention that this is a 2S battery too. This is the Beta FPV uh, 450 milliamp hour 2S battery. And this thing has a lot more punch than the Blade Torrent does on 3S. Let's bring this thing in for a landing. Actually, let me grab it. So that's it. A quick reference flight of this King Kong 110 GT after flying the Blade Torrent 110. And uh, I like this a lot better. Thanks for watching.